Hey, what's up, y'all? It's your girl, The Key Is Me, and I am back again with another video. Now, y'all know I'm always coming and showing y'all the affordable hairstyles and the looks. So in this video, I am going to be reviewing some clippings that I received from Lacer Hair. These clippings are from Amazon. So sis, if you got Amazon Prime, pretty sure it might you might get next door shipping. But anyways, these clippings are so, so, so affordable right now. They're priced at $50 on their website. I did get two different sets of clip-ins so you're going to see two styles in this video one is going to be your regular kinky curly and the next one is going to be afro kinky curly so as you can see my head my hair is in a standard ponytail you do not have to do too much when it comes to clip-ins and i'm going to place the clip-ins in with the ponytail now right here you're going to see the kinky curly hair straight out of the box i did not have to pre-wash this hair and this is what it looks like in its natural form without any product no product Product, no shampoo no conditioner no oil no nothing all I did was just blend my regular hair in with the actual clip-ins so here I'm going to show you how I get the clip-ins to pretty much match my hair texture when I define the actual curls so what you want to do is you want to make sure that you fully drench the hair in water I'm using just some warm water um, inside of a spray bottle and then I'm going to finger detangle the hair now it's, it is easier for you to do this if you were to wash the hair first um, so it'd be so the hair will already be detangled and you can kind of skip this step then I'm gonna go in with my Lottie body styling foam now I definitely suggest that you use something like a mousse or a styling foam that is not too heavy like gel and go ahead and define the curls and if you do not own a dimming brush what are you waiting for? I use it for all of my curly hair as well as my natural hair. Definitely get you a dim and brush. So that's pretty much what I do to go ahead and define the curls. Again, in the standard texture, the way that it comes straight out of the pack, or you can go ahead and further define the curls like you see here. So here I'm just going to be showing you how I actually put the clip-ins inside of my hair. Right now, I am going to be using the Afro Kinky Curly. And as you can see, they do have the ombre color to them. I'm going to show you how to actually blend this hair in with your natural black hair if you do have black hair. You can see my hair is in a ponytail. Basically, you just want to place the tracks around the ponytail. You're not placing any on the track or on you're not placing any of the tracks on on the bun or under the bun you're basically just forming them around the bun all the way to the top of your head as well ladies don't be scared to actually cut your clip-ins um just making sure that you don't cut the actual pieces between like inside of the clip but cutting up around the clip so that it can fit in the placement of your hair you definitely won't have any issues with shedding or anything because I didn't just as long as you cut it the right way and you're just gonna pretty much just put the clippings in and I, as you can see I only have a little bit of leave out out so you don't need a lot
as you can see my hair color does not match of course so i went ahead and used this coloring spray from the hair store the color that i have is a black brown and as you can see when i spray it on here you see how it's changing the color instantly this color actually mimics this ombre perfectly i didn't want to spray it all over my natural hair so i just sprayed it towards the end so that it gave that gradient effect to actually blend into the hair it's up to you and what you want to do but if you sprayed it on your natural hair it blends in very 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 well i probably should have recorded that part but i did test it and it does look absolutely amazing so i believe you can find this at any local beauty supply store or if not i'm pretty sure they have it online just type the, type the title inside of google i'm telling you google's your best friend when you don't know something i'm telling you because i know it <laughs> i use it all the time so you just want to just take your brush and just continuously rub your hands through it to spread the product again these clippings can be purchased on amazon as you can see i'm popping up on the screen right now the actual store site on amazon as well as the price i'm telling you these these might be the cheapest clippings i've ever had i love the texture of the hair the only thing i don't like is that I don't think you'll be able to straighten these and get it back to the way that it was before. I did kind of test it. The curls did revert back, but it wasn't the same. So I'm going to put the information down in the description box below. Thank you so much for tuning into this video. If you could please like, comment, subscribe, and share. And I look forward to seeing my next video.